what's up guys welcome back to tech brute ifs and in today's video um i'll be giving us a strategy i'll be combining three indicators as you can see in my chart let me remove this one i won't be needing it today as you can see i have three indicators i have the parabolic sir i have the ema and i have the cci which is um commodity channel index okay the cci okay all right so um please don't forget to always comment if today is your first time don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell to always get notified when i drop a new video all right and um if you really want to make profit from this market from this market using this strategy watch the end of the video because i will be giving out the, the, the setup for this strategy okay let's go right into it all right this strategy is very simple and it's meant for minute chart trading for scalpers for those people who scalp the market in this trading you only scalp for a couple of minutes without much stop loss all right so this strategy doesn't entail you staying long in the market all right you just um, um come into the market trade a bit and leave the market okay so um first of all let's look at the parabolic star this was actually designed by Wellness welder and he's also the author of um rsi so he he's very good in you know designing or altering um indicators for trends okay trend strategic indicators and the SAR is also known as the stop and reverse stop and reverse and it has different um different things that it does but two, there are two major things that we use the parabolic star to do we we'll use it to eliminate the lagging of trend indicators and we as well the second thing we as well use it to find points of reversal in the market that's what we use the parabolic star to do the parabolic star is just it looks like a dotted line what you can see just on my chart or uh, like this this is a, this is a parabolic star the, the black dotted lines are the parabolic stars and it's it's very very important that you understand it okay it helps you to trade the forest market easily you know pinpointing the reversal stages of the market okay then the next one is the cci all right the cci the commodity channel index all right the commodity channel index all right um this shows how price deviates from its average value so we only use it for to, to determine deviation from the average value of a particular price at a particular time and most times it's it's very very um easy to dictate the direction and the stage of the market all right so um the ema that's um the ema that we'll be using it's only meant for one minute time we have it for five minutes and for one minute time all right and it determines the um the movement of the price the strength of the movement of the price at every particular time all right okay so let's dive right in into the signal and the strategy how to use and combine the three of them as you can see right here as you can see right here i have three indicators i have the moving average the ea moving average i have the um the parabolic SAR indicator and i have the cci the commodity channel index all right so for us to trade this market there are certain things that we'll be looking out for now we'll look out for the first thing we will look out for we'll check the um parabolic star all right we'll look out to find if there is a break between the parabolic star and the ea moving average the ea um indicator the moving average the exponential moving average all right we look out for spaces or points where the parabolic star breaks either above or beneath the moving average all right okay for for instance we have we have a point here now we, we are not considering the price right here we are considering only the indicators we are looking at the indicators and not the price all right so once we see this crossover right here once we see this crossover right here okay we enter a sell but we don't just sell because we've seen a crossover we sell because there is a confluence between the ea the parabolic star and the cci now your cci must be at the minus 100 end so if it is at the minus 100 that means it is a selling market so you have to do what enter the market so let's look at look at it and see how how we can trade with it okay how we can sell with it all right so this is it this is where the parabolic star crossed the ea moving average remember we are not looking at the price we are looking at the 
indicators all right see it so had it been we entered the market around here here we took it down to this point if you wish to hold this is about 143 pips remember we only exit when the cci is moving towards zero points this zero region all right this zero region this region here once it starts entering this region we exit the market like what happened here um let me let me show you something let me show you something like what happened here once it started entering all right we we saw a strong reversal it started entering right here we saw a very what strong reversal a strong reversal that took up to this point that took about how many pips that took about 49 pips okay so now once the reversal is done we don't just enter again okay we've seen a crossover here but we don't enter until we see a clear confirmation of the ea a confluence between the ea and the para parabolic sa and the cci so it happened around there so we would have taken another peep now if you're scalping for um the market i always advise you take three to four candles three to four five minute candles three to four five minute candles that is you were trading for 20 20 minutes 15 to 20 minutes all right and you exit the market then your uh your sl should be below the moving average so your sl should be below this moving average this is where your sl is supposed to be all right then for instance this other one should be above here this is where your sl should be all right so i've shown you how to sell and how to buy using the um uh, three um and the three indicators you don't sell you don't buy inside here you buy above once the line is above you buy once it comes back you sell once it comes down to this point you sell so that's how you trade it basically that's how you trade it so let's um check out for another um another asset let's use um probably boom 1000 let's use boom 1000 okay see see what's happening here see what's happening here now watch watch false breakouts here this all these are called false breakouts okay all these are false breakouts false breakouts you see it we cannot just enter the market immediately so you see see right here a false breakout a false breakout because the cci is still inside the zero zone so we don't just enter so had it been we wanted to sell here we would have sold from here remember how many candles four candles three to four candles you can make it five candles at your own risk okay you can even take up to 10 as you can see, as you can see here we have up to 10 candles all right we have up to 10 candles here so starting from here we sold and got our profit all right so um if you want to buy it if you want to buy it this is this is a crossover right here this is a crossover right here all right the parabolic side is crossing so if we wanted to buy this is where we would have bought along this zone this is where we would have bought buy here and take all of these candles all right so that is how you, you trade it. You can go to back test and check it out. Don't forget to subscribe to Take Butai FX because we'll be bringing you strategies on how to trade the boom and uh, boom and crash market, how to trade the forest market, and we'll be very soon. We'll be coming out with our um, price action tutorials. Price action tutorials by April. We'll be unfolding our price action tutorials. So get ready to become a more profitable trader using our strategies and indicator teachings thank you so much see you in the next video